Basketball Confederation will be hosting the 2013 Friendship Basketball Tournament at the FD Phoenix Center starting tomorrow night. Teams competing in the tournament are the Guam National Men's Basketball Team, the National University Bulldogs from the Philippines, Korea University, and the Anderson Bombers. We have the Friendship Tournament starting this Wednesday to Saturday, uh, two games a night. Uh, games will be nightly six and, six and eight. Uh, participating teams are uh, a Philippine team, the National University from Manila, uh, Korea University, the Anderson Bombers, and the Guam National Team. Tickets are available at uh, selected Shell stations. That would be um, the Tri Intersection in Barragada, Shell, Dededo Shell, Timuning, Mingilao Shell, and uh, all three National Office Supply locations. Tickets will be available at the door. Um, it's ten dollars. You can. Uh, it's good for both games for the night, and um, you know, just come out and enjoy some basketball. Mike Dewey will be competing this weekend in the Michelob Ultra Bodybuilding Championships at the Leo Palace Resort. Mike has been training around the clock for the event, making his final adjustments as the competition nears. Half a day Guam, my name is Mike Dewey. I'll be competing in the 2013 uh, Michelob Ultra Guam Bodybuilding Competition. Well, as the competition nears, um, pretty much what we do is just get our practice down, like for our posing just to make sure that you know we hit those poses right on stage because you know it's it's kind of useless building all that muscle and then not be able to showcase it on stage so we, we pretty much that's the last minute things we do is the posing guess po or the posing practice posing and then just little adjustments like we go by how I look actually uh, going towards the competition so it's up to Tony Morrison, like he'll advise me what to take out, such as cardio or, you know, my meals, what to replace in the meals. Just minor things to adjust just by how I look. So you can catch Mike and the rest of the local competitors at the press conference this Friday at three o'clock at the Leo Palace Resort. Spike 22's Kyle Uggen will be headlining PXC 40 this Friday at the UOG Fieldhouse when he takes on Japan fighter Michinori Tanaka for the 135 pound title. It's been a long road for Uggen who finally gets his shot at bringing home the belt. After the last fight I just went straight into training again on the coming Monday from that fight with Russell Duane. I was already in shape so I just kept it consistent. Uh, stayed, stayed, everything stayed the same. Um, I stayed here for my camp Spike 22. Um, concentrated wrestling. Um, Snock is a great scrambler, so I just did everything, uh, mixed martial arts, uh, jiu-jitsu, wrestling, boxing, everything I played, everything. I've been trying to play on my back more because I know he's a good wrestler, so if he does put me on my back, I'll be ready for anything. I had my ups and downs. I lost a couple of times. I was number one contender a couple of times, but I didn't get to fight for the belt, but this is my time now, so I'm, there's no belts here in Guam. There's no belts here at Spike. I'm bringing that belt back to Spike and back to Guam. With the home turf advantage on his side, Kyle is eager to get into the cage and put his wrestling to the test against Tanaka, who will be defending his title for the first time in hostile territory. Walking up that stairs where the smoke's coming out, everyone's screaming your name. Man, I can't even explain that, that feeling, you know. Um, like, everyone's screaming your name. I'm just like, dang, all the pressure is coming onto me, walking down. But it just motivates me it's that I got to win and this is going to be my time. So. Right when I enter that ring, everything just drops, everything just, I'm just concentrated on the guy and nothing else. 